Hello, I am Martin Fenska and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Civilization 5 as Egypt. So the goal for today is to take Edirne. I actually had to change my plans a little bit. I wanted to completely remove Ottomans from the map during this war, but I don't think I'll be able to take the island city. Now it's strength 70, uh, two field guns are not enough anymore to take it. So I'll just uh, retreat. Uh, what I really need from this war to op is to open access to Germany from the north. So Edirne is what we take and then at some point we'll end up fighting the Ottomans again but by the time we should have uh, some cruisers and um, probably corvettes will also be upgraded. So then we will just uh, slowly take the city down. Uh, I'm a bit afraid that if I move the field guns in and they start taking damage, I wouldn't be able to like move them away from the peninsula and losing uh, units in a siege that uh, s probably can't be won anyway. It's just a bad idea. Okay. Um, we can still attack down here. Might even get a kill. Uh, yep, okay, good. Anything else? Well, just fortify. Also, I'll move this field guns. Actually, how many field guns do we have? One. This is gonna be two. I oh, might as well do it. So, I think we'll be using three siege weapons against Edirne. Uh, okay, so we want to end the turn and hope that uh, the war awareness goes down because I'm pretty sure the cost of upgrades is increased because of the war awareness. We are at 1780 uh, for Kirasiers, so let's keep an eye on that. What is this? Tercio? Yeah, you can stay here, you can stay here as well. We are raising the city, so maybe I should keep some units around. The Lancer can stay here. And let's move one Kirasir this way. Okay, keep working on that railroad. I will have to keep some branch units around here uh, because the next time we declare on Siam they will have navy again. But I probably don't want to keep Kerasiers. I want Kerasiers in the front line on the other side. We can maybe just buy some uh, machine guns at some point or I mean machine guns, Gatling guns. But I'll keep the general around. Fortify, fortify. Okay, what are you doing here? Let's keep an eye on that cost. 1605, so it is going down. Question is how much we can reduce the cost. It's still way too expensive. Uh, this is a nice catch. 
And what the hell happened here? Okay, let's just control those field guns manually. We almost lost it. can move back and we're gonna need all the kerasiris that we can get Let's get armor and then probably arsenal. We have to uh, fortify all the cities on this co on this coast. Uh, armory. Look at that! It's already size 17 and still growing very quickly. Okay, fine. Let's speed things up even more. Go. engineer nice and how does it look like down here uh, can we take out another ship we can okay and this inquisitor can return back north because we don't need them for this city. Uh, can I just... Now let's wait. When we get the, the Kerasir into the city, we'll just use him for the kill to get the, uh, the extra production. He will stay in the city. Fortify. And move up. Thinking about going with bombardment. This five percent combat strength compared to ten percent versus London naval units. But um, once we get the naval superiority, it doesn't matter if we have to siege cities uh, one turn longer. It's all about just killing units and then we have all the time in the world to take cities. Now let's go with targeting. Targeting two. Maybe we can get some experience from the units around Cape Town. Um, okay. You will hide behind the city and heal up. Pillage. I thought it would be just a question of a few turns taking it in and uh, it's uh, turning into like a 20 turn operation. seaports how much coal do we have that's also important uh, still should be enough and I should probably send a worker 
to mine this coal. Uh, let's actually leave the facility around. We want to, to provide some cover for that worker. And we got 20 happiness in one turn somehow. Let's check the upgrade costs. 1455. Well, it's going down, but uh, not as much as I had hoped. Hmm. With these prices, I upgrade six units and we are done and we burn 10,000. But the problem is, unless I upgrade our units. Uh, the Siege of Edirne will be a bloodbath. One, two, three, four. That will be enough, I think. Okay, uh, where is the third field gun? There just isn't one. Yeah, the closest one is here and that is still one, two, three, four, like five turns. <clears throat> Okay, next. They left the general unprotected? Are they really so stupid? And Pakal just entered modern era. Is he the first one to enter modern era? Uh, 50 tags. We have... Holy moly, Pakal. Are you crazy? Um, I thought he wouldn't be a problem, but maybe I was wrong. Okay, dude, listen. Let me just end this. Great. I think at this point the sea tiles are actually better than like another engineer slot. We get engineer in 16, that's fast enough. And sea tiles are definitely better than the oasis. Okay. Constabulary, then we will build arsenal. We have your train station. Now we can get. That's a good question, actually. start building zoos for the happiness I don't really need grocers another option would be military academy for the science and it's basically like illiteracy and distress reduction in one building. Now let's get zoo.
Okay, let's start moving. I could kill the general, but then I would probably risk losing my cavalry. That's not worth it. One more general, we do. Okay, fine, we're gonna use both. How many Janissaries do you have? One, two, three, four, two field guns. That's a lot of damage, but it's also very squishy. Okay, if somehow he just got two facilities. I have no idea where they came from. Fortifying, fortifying, fortifying. Archaeologist. Great. Probably have to sacrifice a few units here, you know, like one or two fusiliers. Missing one frontline unit. Yeah, this guy's probably gonna die. It's a lot of range damage around him, but I don't really have a choice. Oh, I didn't expect this to be a one shot. Okay, fine. Now let's just wait like this. Let's see what happens. It's definitely possible that we're gonna lose a, a unit there. But um, if they decide to keep units around to get kills, then we're gonna destroy them next turn. Fortify, 
What is this? Uh, complete espionage against Bismarck. I don't really care about that. I mean, the science would be nice. But I probably have to focus on mm, protecting my own cities. Might be better. Okay, can we peace on with some city states? Why the hell am I at war with so many city states? Angry, angry. Okay, this is fine. So we are now fighting just Antwerp. Go. We have all these units coming north. Ethernet is basically just a huge bottleneck. Once we get the mo more open terrain here, uh, Cologne will also be a bit of a problem. But once you get to the open terrain, it should be so much easier. Next. Nope. Okay, there's the kill. Yep. Kind of expected that. But, uh, as I said, now they had to keep units around for that kill, so let's try to take advantage of that. Forgetting that I should send one worker north. Okay, you'll do it. Oh, hey. Let's wait. I want the extra production. Uh, now, you remove the railroad, and you can remove this railroad and there's combustion and with that modern era uh, I should probably check how did Pakal enter modern era. He already has biology and corporations. Damn. But that means he doesn't have combustion. So he wants probably rush plastics for research labs. Which means I will never get the Empire State Building. Okay, let's go... Combined Arms. And... We just get advanced units and try to crush everyone before they run away tech-wise.
oil perfect we do have oil seven there is more oil here it's already 14 17 24 oh perfect 31 oil so the end game units shouldn't be a problem we just have to improve all the oil yep that's not a problem also we now have access to land ships hmm. I'm not used to uh, being in this position this late in the game so I may have to use units that are usually don't like even consider for excited materials damn he is fast what the hell Let's get a train station. We definitely need more production around here. And how does the city have access to stoneworks? Oh, there's stone. Yeah, I didn't see that. Okay, fine. With one stone, is this, this is worth the three production for one gold per turn. I'll take that. One more attack, no. Okay, this can still turn into a bloodbath, but uh, I ba I'm basically now taking away tiles from them, tiles that they can use uh, to get the units into better position. So the more pressure I'm like putting on them, uh, the easier the war should become. I should have one more attack, one more. Might even have one attack here and kill that field gun. Great. So there's what one genocide in the city. That's gonna be the biggest problem, I think. And there is one here with the general. Where are our uh, siege weapons? Come on, keep moving. Fortify, fortify. Okay, next. Yeah, this is fine. As long as they can't one-shot our units, we can just uh, rotate everything around. Um, 
this is fine. It can retreat. Heal up. I want to save this tile for the Fusilier. Look at the damage. How much money do we have? 1200, that's not enough. Could still keep moving. Pressure them even more. What if I do have naval support, not from a corvette? And I think moving the facilitator forward is probably better. Let's move the general. Okay, great. This looks good. Host. Well, Germany is going to be the host. And I don't really care about modifiers with him because he's the next target. I could try to suck up to Arabia. It really doesn't matter. Who's starving? Who oh, that's starving? Why? Good. And we definitely need a garden here. On military academy for the science. Go. Yep, this is fine. Germany remains host, that's not a surprise. People want the Ottomans to become the host, look at that. Ethiopia and Bayov both voted for the Ottomans. I'd really like to know like the decision making for uh, the AIs when it comes to um, choosing the host why would they try to make the ottomans the host i mean that makes no sense ottomans are half dead they're by far the weakest save and uh, like two much stronger saves like two strongest saves in the game i'm not counting us are trying to make them the leader of the world uh council what the hell The 
personal. Now, our capital. That's a good question. I want more archaeologists, and I think I will have. Oh, wait. Uh, I can't. We, all, we have all three archaeologists still on the map. Well, in that case, we can just get military academy again for the science. Opera house. Museum. About stoneworks here. No, that would be useless. I think I'll get grosser here. This is a little bit low on food. And then military academy. You need your seaport. somewhere else. We could use the railroad to Philadelphia. Sure. And I think this worker can help with the actual. I'll send this one here and this one here. Wonder if I can kill the Genesary. Attack. No, it's gonna be closed, but I can't. At least we can kill the Tercio. We're gonna need one more Fusilier. Are there any Fusiliers on the way? Here's one. I can always send uh, the Kerasir. Fortify, fortify. Okay. Let's get some more oil. Go. Can at least make sure that the genocide doesn't get away. No matter what he does now, I should be able to kill him next turn.
need this fusilier to survive a little bit longer. Next turn I can even swap these two. Yeah, that looks good. Now the city should go down pretty quickly. And then we can finally peace out. Um. Let's give the oil tile to Alexandria. It's uh, really bad now, but uh, once the oil well is up, it should be like 10 production. Uh, Academy... Let's go. Zoo, Musicians Guild, and maybe then we can start making archaeologists here. And we'll be building ships in our capital with some more uh, cruisers, probably. Fortify. Can you still shoot? Wait, can I do it this way? Attack, shoot, get the extra production, take the camp. Yep, that's better. Train station. How are we doing? Three more coal. But there is work on the way, so we get seven more. 24,000 faith, wow. 85 unit cap with 13% from War Baroness. That's not bad. How are we doing on Golden Age? It's halfway. And we have two artists sitting in our capital, so... Oh, there is a, another one on the way. We don't have to worry about Golden Ages for a while. Can we shoot? We can. Next. I don't care about you. Did he kill my agent or something? How does he know? German still research from Memphis. Yeah, there are agents like in half of our city, so I'll never be able to protect uh, everything completely. There is more oil. Go. And how does it look like? Not doing as much damage as I hoped. Six hundred and twenty-six. So we did what, like two hundred damage? It's not that bad. The added damage from all the cavalry uh, actually makes a pretty noticeable difference. Minefield around Philadelphia. Twenty turns would be too long, so I'll sacrifice thousand gold on that. Uh, you got your train station. Okay, museum time. Go 
grocer into military academy. I think that was the plan. Hopefully, actually, let's swap here. Hopefully, we won't need uh, any upgrades before we get rid of the War Baroness. It's again up to 34. And I'm pretty sure once he completely removed the War Baroness, the upgrades will be like, uh, I don't know, 40% of what they are now. No. Don't like their f that they're focusing on the field guy. Uh, Pakal declared in Germany. Well, that doesn't mean anything. They are just it's just impossible for them basically to meet ever. It's just the kind of war because I'm bored, so I'm gonna declare war on you. Uh, where can we get more oil? I think someone is already going for this oil. Let's send the worker here. Everything looks good. It's gonna be probably a long episode, but I really want to uh, get Ederne today. City bombardment is doing a lot of damage. Mark enters modern era. Oh, hey, Suleiman declared on the Ram, but it's because a Ram declared on Bismarck. Oh man, this is a great opportunity for us. We just have to get Adirna out of the way. We should uh, get the city basically by the time Germany runs out of units, we'll be ready to declare. There will be no units in the area because they'll all be fighting Sam. If we could just somehow convince Arabia to declare on Ethiopia, they have the same amount of tax. I have to say that uh, I really dislike uh, this patch until like the end of medieval era but um, at this point everyone is basically on par so that makes for some pretty interesting endgame wars except uh, the terrain makes it quite annoying but other than that i do like this Hope that the field gun survives. How are you doing? Thirty hit points. Twenty. Next turn we should get the city. Much money, four and a half. Okay, let's get the train station. Go. 
go. Yeah, Ottoman artifact will do. Let's see, we have 1390 culture per turn. So that's plus 12. Uh, that's decent. Go. I like how the AI knows that it's gonna lose the city next turn and it's evacuating the civilians. Golden Age undead. Well, good thing is that uh, we are still at positive happiness when the golden age ended but we of course need the golden age 15 more turns yeah that's reasonable uh, in 15 turns we should start the natural one again i think and it's like 200 gold per turn difference I think it's time to start building musicians guild. It's gonna be one. What the boy? I hope I can take the city. 161. Wait, I don't have a unit in position to take it. Oops. Okay, in that case, let's save the field gun. Would you please die finally? There. Okay, we'll have to wait one more turn. Oh, 45, 45. Go. Ideology. Who? Ethio Ethiopia adopted order. We probably want autocracy this time. And we should get it in a few turns. And uh, we take the city, there'll be some extra culture. So I would say in like two turns we get our ideology as well. Fear of influence about religion, scholars in residence. Repeal scholars in residence. Yeah, sure. I don't mind. Mm -hmm. Let's get the harbor. Probably won't be able to get factories everywhere, we don't have enough coal, so I'll save factories for our, our largest cities. Mm, 
Finally. It's not in the best shape. Uh, let's get a puppet. Can we get one more kill somewhere? No. So what can we get from him? Nothing. World map, maybe? That could be useful. And what? 70? 80? Never do math on camera. There you go, now we can see everything. Berenger Crater. What was the last one there? I thought we still needed two. Hmm. This looks very different from my from what I expected. Arabia is pretty small. Germany oh, really? Germany took Arabian City? Good job. Well, they're gonna lose it. Uh, they're probably gonna lose it to Bakal, or who are you fighting? Uh, Sam, Maya... Yeah, I think he's gonna lose it to Bakal. I don't think that Maya is here. Uh, can we peace out with Ethiopia? No. Oh god, this is gonna be a pain in the ass. Look at that. This kind of looks like Italy. The Alps here. And the boot. Yeah, impossible to take from the north. Let's see. Well, we can use siege weapons from all these tiles. And once we are through... Uh... We should be actually fine, especially once we get some bombers. And what about Palenque? We can just go this way. Um, it's a little bit more open here than I expected. I thought that this will be just uninterrupted uh, mountains. And we would have to get to Palenque somehow from the north. Sukhothai could actually be the last capital that we take. Hmm. Uh, I'll check the map again off camera. Uh, make sure I didn't miss any of the details. And look at the reward. 10,000. Yeah, we're definitely gonna need the money. There's still quite a few upgrades that we need. Golden Age points. That also helps. That's a really nice reward. How are we doing on war awareness? 37. That's quite reasonable. Uh, I could just invest all of the fate that we have to remove religious divisions. And we'll be around, let's see, uh, 57. Well, like 65 happiness at that point. Yeah, I think I'm gonna do that, uh, by the way. Do we have any followers here? No, not a single one. Fine, that's why we have missionaries and an inquisitor. We're gonna need one more. Good. So as I said, off camera, uh, I'll check the map again and uh, I'll have to think about the war with Germany. Let me see. Defensive pact with Ottomans. <laughs> so we just ended one war with them and in, uh, let's say, four turns, we're gonna start another one indirectly. Yeah, I'll just move everything into position and then we start the attack with uh, all the siege weapons here and uh, all German units in the south. We'll probably siege both Essen and Frankfurt at the same time. And then try to take Munich and Cologne before 
uh, they end the war with Siam. Because I don't want to fight here in the bottleneck when uh, we are or when Germany is fighting just us. But for today we are done. So I hope that you like this episode. I hope that you can join me next time again. And until then, have a good time. Bye bye.